Hi, this is Rich Burnside. I'm the lead on the Denver Innovation Garage Search and Rescue Drone Project. In this video, I'll be demoing some of the capabilities of the 3D Robotics Iris Plus drone and the mission planning software and app that comes with it. First, we open the mission planning app and enter the editor mode. Next, we select the waypoint icon and then touch on the locations we want the drone to fly to. The first and last waypoints will be selected as the takeoff and return to launch locations. This enables the drone to take off and land automatically. When selecting the launch waypoint, we can select the altitude it must reach before heading to the next waypoint. Selecting waypoint 3 will tell the drone to circle that location at an altitude of 20 meters and a radius of 7 meters. Next, we'll connect to the drone and then send the mission to it. Connected. Once the mission is saved to the drone, we'll arm the drone, set it to automatic mode, and let her fly. Waypoint saved to drone. Armed. Waypoints received. As we can see, it launches smoothly, and after it reaches the proper altitude, heads for the next waypoint. Going for waypoint 2. Going for waypoint 3. I selected a circling pattern, but there are many different options, such as cross-hatching an area or spiral up and down in increments. One of the best features of this drone is that it removes all of the difficulty of flying an RC aircraft. A complete novice is able to plan a mission, fly the drone, and land it. Going for waypoint 4. After the circling is finished, the drone returns to the launch position at an altitude of 20 meters and then lowers itself slowly to the ground and disarms itself, and that's it. Thanks for watching this demonstration. If you have any questions, please contact me. 